DLS and DHCP services, University of Westminster IT would fall, fall over and wouldn't work full stop, so it's critical to what we do every day. The university uses uh, Infoblox to deliver all of its services organisational wide. We've been running Infoblox since January 2007. Previously we had an open source system for DNS which worked, worked well but it required an, a specific individual to administer it and our DNS, uh, DHCP services resided on network servers so we needed to collapse the two together. We always look at the market to identify what technology services are available. We looked at some open source systems um, but we chose Infoblox. For us it's significantly the introduction of a higher availability in uh, business recovery procedures. So we're no longer reliant on single points of failure, both technically and, and the human element in terms of administrative. Um, we've been able to scale and develop it as we brought on new systems and services such as IP telephony. Um, and we've allowed our local IT staff to be more responsive and reactive to their customers' needs. We had to ensure that the service was going to work, was going to be robust and uh, scalable, and Infoblox met all those needs. We've got three 1050As running in a high availability pair and a grid master candidate at our secondary data centre, two external 550s and they're running NICE version 6.6. .6. So at the moment we're evaluating the uh, DNS firewall um, module that's just been released on eval, so we're trialling that and also the reporting appliance.